In this video, you are going to know about endospore staining step by step. So let's get started. Hey everyone, this is Agam Singh Sisodia. So before proceeding to endospore staining, we just have to know that what is endospore. So endospore is a resistant spore created by bacteria under unfavorable conditions inside its body. Means that this endospore is resist inside the body of a bacteria under unfavorable conditions. Okay. So in endospore staining, we are going to visualize that endospore in the bacteria inside the bacteria the endospore will looks like greenish in color and the bacteria will looks like dark pinkish or reddish in color because we stain the bacteria with the safranin okay and the procedure of endospore staining is on your screens in a flow chart form it's a very easy technique now we are going to perform this practically you can also take the screenshot of this uh, technique the procedures in a flow chart okay now the requirement for endospore staining the two important stain that is safranin and melichite green these are the two important stains which are used in endospore stainings safranin for counter staining and melichite green for pre staining second thing we requires a filter paper for covering the smear thirdly we requires a dropper and fourth a inoculum loop and fifth one is a clean glass slide which should to be grease free and distilled water beaker and a slide rack and a Bunsen burner for the heat fixing of the smear and the culture we requires for the bacteria which we want to visualize the endospore okay now the procedure is as follows firstly we just have to make a smear and after that we just have to properly heat fix it so that the bacteria will adhere on the surface of the glass slide okay and after that you just have to place the glass slide over the boiling water bath as the arrangement we had made especially for endospore staining and after that you just have to place a piece of filter paper on your smear as such you are looking here and after that you just have to drop few drops of melachite green on the filter paper and fill the filter paper totally with the melachite green and let the smear here for 5 to 10 minutes okay and after 5 to 10 minutes you just have to take your slide away from this boiling water bath and remove the filter paper from the slide okay and after that you just have to wash it wash the smear carefully with the distilled water and totally rinse out all the rest of uh, melichite green from the slide so that you can visualize the endospores properly with their proper shape if the excess of melichite green is to be present on the slide then the proper shape of the endospores should not to be visualized and after that you just have to counter stain with safranin and let it to be for 30 seconds okay and after 30 seconds you just have to wash the safranin with the distilled water carefully and make it to be properly careful because if the excess of safranin is here you are not getting the proper shape of the bacteria also and after that you just have to visualize the slide under microscope under 100x of power and you can see the result as follows the bacteria will looks like pinkish or reddish in color while the endospore will looks like greenish in color now let's visualize it clearly in this figure you see that bacteria are rod shape pinkish in color while the endospores are oval in shape and forming bunch of endospores so i hope this video is helpful for you if you like this video then give it a thumbs up and if you have any query then you can ask in the comment box down below and if you have any friend that want that knowledge then share this video with them and if you haven't subscribed this channel then subscribe the channel to get more interesting videos such like that thank you so much for watching see you soon